Hi guys, Pie Five Pizza. Pretty easy Easter egg, not too bad. It's actually a lot of fun, but um, we're gonna show you the main Easter egg and all the fun little uh, uh, um, like side mission stuff. Now some of them we're not gonna do just because they're not really worth doing, but the ones that are worth doing we're definitely gonna show you, as well as free perks and just how to get her done. So Jason and I already beat it, so we're just gonna show you how we did it, and uh, yeah, hopefully this video helps you out. Let's do it, Jason. Let's bang it out. So first thing we got to do, uh, we have to find five, four or five of these uh, soul boxes here. Just fill them up as you go. Luckily, they're in a kind of like an opening order. So the way you open the doors is the order at which um, you'll get them done. That one's almost done. We're going to open this door. And then we're going to activate. It's going to say brute force attack this thing. Just brute force attack it. Why not? And then here's the first part of power. So yeah, now in here you'll see there's a make pies thing really no point so you can just make pies and get points But it's not really worth it. So uh, we're gonna skip that now. We're gonna work on opening this next door Cool, so now it gives you a drop um, This thing's really good, but obviously you don't get it forever We're not gonna use it right now just because it it kills every zombie on the map basically it's like a mini nuke so um we got the first one done. Now we're going to move on to the next area. Jason just opened the front door. If you could take a right, there's actually an MP40 here for a thousand, which is really good, surprisingly. Um, so we're not going to worry about it. I'm actually going to get a different gun later on. Now we're going to get into this next area, which is this uh, restaurant. So we're going to open the restaurant for 15. If we go back to here, this is the second um soul box there's only one way which is quite nice so we're just gonna sit here do some killing you know the huge give them the biz still working on that one it's not quite done now we're going to find uh the first pack-a-punch part it's actually in here sometimes it's honestly the hardest place to find it is right here because it blends in so well but that means it's in the kitchen so i'm gonna open this door it's probably right here yep nice i think there's one more spawn for that but um we actually uh, haven't found that one. So now here's the second part of power. So that's both parts of power. You don't need anything else. We'll do power in a second. We're going to finish this soul box out. Uh, there's something you can do in here that's... Um, you can basically get food orders out. And it only gives you, what, like 200 points. And you can only do it once per round. So again, not really worth it. I'm all out of ammo, which is not good. Let me grab... The Let me grab the fucking thing! Fuck! Yeah, that's so weird. I can't grab So out here is the mystery box. The ACR is right here, which is what I'm going to buy. Fantastic gun. Here's where you build power. Boom. Turn on power. And now we're rocking, dude. Rocking. So this takes you back to the starting room. Super easy. All right. So from power, if you go back here, there's a third soul box right here. Perfect. In the perfect spot. So the soul box that we just finished is right there. We're going to get the first shield part, which is actually behind the dumpster here. Sometimes it spawns over there or in, I believe it's in the, it, oh no, it's uh, outside. Uh, 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 uh. It's outside on the side of one of the trucks, but uh, we've never had that one spawn. So might not have to worry about it. So we're actually going to go back inside the restaurant real fast. We're going to take a left into here. And we're going to start the second brute force, which you just slam that computer. And then we're ready to move on to kind of the next area. So we're right outside the restaurant. Take a left if you're looking towards the parking lot to Orange Theory. We're going to open this. Jason, I need you to open it. Thank you. Sweet. So now what we're going to do, we're going to get rid of our M16 or M14. Pick up this RPG and we're going to go outside real fast and take a left. And this is where the last computer is. So you have to shoot, boom, and you'll hear the ding. So unfortunately, we lost our gun, but it's all right. We don't really need it. We have the ACR, which is all anyone ever needs. Now, you can actually pump some iron here. And um, by pumping iron, you get like 200 points each time you do it. Um, pretty nice. I won't lie. It's a good 200 points. You can do that every round. So now we're going to go out to the back. Jason, just open this door. Now that we did all of the... Um, the computers this will spawn if you don't do the computers this won't spawn this is the launch pad that takes you up to the top of the pizza place the, the spawn basically 
This is the uh, party bus, as you can as you can probably tell. And over here is a pack a punch part as well as a shield part. So the pack a punch part is probably by Jason, right? Yep. So here's a pack a punch part, and here's a shield part. Again, always going to be around orange theory. So um, yep, we're we're pretty much good to go. We're going to take that time warp, even though we really don't have to. Boom. Now we're going to foof to here. And then here is the next soul box, as well as jugs. Now, let's talk about perks real fast. You can have all the perks on the map, but the only ones that you really need are jugs, stamina up because we're going to run LMGs, uh, speed, and double tap. That's really all you're going to need. Uh, so we'll show you where those are. Jugs is right here on top. Speed is in the restaurant. If you keep going straight into the kitchen, it's right here. So that's speed. Stam is in orange theory here. And then uh, double tap we haven't opened yet, but we'll show you where that is. But those are the four perks that we're going to run. Sweet. Jason finished this one. So now we have enough to go to the bog. So if you go past the sleep outfitters, Jason's gonna open this door that takes us to the bog or cabin, whatever you wanna call it. So just go straight. Before we go in, there's going to be a pack-a-punch part. So the pack-a-punch part is in this area. Sometimes it's next to this machine here. Nope, so that means it is in the cabin, I believe. So I'm gonna open this. It's gonna give you a little jump scare. It's just this it's not that big of a deal but it does last a while so just sit here and wait so that's done here's double tap sometimes the shield part will spawn here here is the second pack a punch part or last pack a punch part sorry and then here is the shield part that we're looking for so right now jason and i are gonna bang out this last um soul box hopefully we have enough ammo but uh we don't want to go down here if we go down here it's kind of a Kind of a huge bummer, but I got enough ammo, I think. So we just finished the last one. It says, I am pleased. So now we are going to head back to um, the restaurant. So it says, I am pleased, which means that this door back here in the restaurant is open. So this is the teleporter. So we're going to hold to link, and then we're going to go back to the, um, the uh, jump. Once we get to the jump, the jump pad, uh... It's smooth sailing. So we take the junk pad up to here. We're going to hit this box right here to turn on the grid. So that links the teleporters. Now it costs 420 points to teleport. Ooh, that's a huge, huge max ammo. Um, so I'm going to teleport right now. Jason doesn't really have to come with me. But we're going to get the key card. So this teleports you to the gas station. Zombies do spawn here. Um, we're going to build... Pack a punch, just in case you want it. You actually don't really need it, but uh, it, just in case you want it, because we're gonna have powerful weapons. We're also gonna grab this detonator here for a free weapon, and then we have to go over here and we gotta shoot this guy in the face so he drops this key. Pick up the key card, and now it's just gonna teleport you out whenever. You can loot the cash registers, which I'm gonna do since I'm here. Gives you 420. Uh, no need to pack a punch any of these because we're going to get rid of them. So now you're basically done with the Easter egg. Uh, we've accomplished everything that we have to. The only thing left is to open one door with the key card that we just got and then get 55,000 points with Jason, which Jason and I already did. Um, the only thing that uh, we're going to show you left is when we get our perks, we're going to show you a free perk. Um, and then we're also going to show you um, how to get two free weapons. And one of the weapons is the best gun in the game by far. Again, we have the key card, so I'm going to open toast. the gate. A toast to success. And then we're going to shoot right there to get Blink's, Blink 420's armory, which is pretty cool. So the armory that we just shot is behind the bank. It's like right here, behind the gym, sorry. We're also going to build the zombie shield. Right here, boom. So now we have a zombie shield. We're gonna take a right. Here's the armory. The AUG, cool and all, but we're gonna grab this, the buzzsaw, because the buzzsaw has a stupid amount of ammo, or a stupid amount of ammo and does a lot of damage. Now, you have to wait for a max ammo, which kind of sucks, so keep your ACR. The other thing we're gonna do is we're gonna go through the bus. 
I'm actually going to get rid of my ACR, even though I know that's kind of crazy to say, but place explosive, shoot the explosive, and now here is a minigun. It's a free minigun, has 974 bullets. Might want to save them until you get a max ammo for right now, but um, yeah. I'm going to kill these two. One, two. I'm going to take this. And just because we can, we're going to upgrade our dragon shields. Or, well, upgrade our shields to the dragon shield. But Yeah, honestly, don't know what this does. I think it just gives it more health. Um, but, yeah. So, now we're just going to get our perks. And then we'll show you where the free perks are. Come on, max ammo. Worst comes to worst, guys. I don't know if you've noticed these. But uh, you can actually buy ammo for 4,000. And with the buzzsaw, you're definitely going to want to do that um, if you don't get a max ammo. But once you get one max ammo, you're pretty much good for the game. This thing has uh, 12, 1250 ammo. So, so now that we've opened this and we're pretty much good to go and we're just saving. Or you guys are just saving because, again, we've done this. You're going to get a lot of molars here. Just run through this. Just keep shooting this. This is, <laughs> this is pretty easy. If you have this... You're pretty much golden. But here's the buyable ending for 55,000. Uh, you're going to get swarmed by these emolars at the beginning. Just kill them real quick. They they move slow. You can also run into them and they'll explode. But uh, you don't want to do that just yet. You know, like you don't want to take the risk. Now, two things I want to show you. So one thing I forgot to do. If you go into the armory here, there's actually free money. So you can just take this money. It'll actually stack. Uh, so it's 1,000 for each. Or 1500 How much is it? Yeah, 1500 for each stack here. Um, that's a lot. That's a good way of getting money. And then also there's a free 5000 in uh, the gym. If you shoot this lock, it just blows open. Steal from register. Easy 5K. So you guys know how to pack a punch. The only thing we have left to show you guys is the free perks. So I am grabbing my last perk, which is double tap. Now, as I said, you can have unlimited perks, so you don't have to do this. But if you're just wanting to do everything, I guess... Uh, there's three free perk bottles that gets you one free perk. So the first bottle is right here outside of the cabin. The second one is in this doorway of the uh, restaurant is right here before the soul box. And then the last one is in spawn room right here. Boom. Got electric cherry. So you can also buy electric cherry at, um, pack a punch, but yeah, that's pretty much it guys. Jason and I already finished, uh, this map anyway. Um, so yeah, we're just going to end it there. And uh, hopefully it helped you guys out. But I'll splice in us beating it too. So hopefully that, hopefully you guys, as proof, as proof that it's another map that we decimated. Okay, so peace, peace. <clears throat> you have 30 seconds to get on. Okay. <laughs> oh, and the zombies don't come on. Okay. Oh, wait, is that it? I don't know. Maybe. I guess we're waiting 30. What you gonna do? What you gonna do? So it just gives everyone time to run. Truck is leaving. Let's go. Do we do it? <sighs> I have no idea who that is. <laughs> I don't anything. <sighs> nice job. You escaped. Yay. Good shit, Jason. Ooh, old styles. <laughs> Copyrighted, but good. It's okay, it's okay. All right, sweet. Good job.